hopefully this is just full of water and not gas. But let's clean up my boat, which a lot of you guys didn't know I had a boat. But yeah, I have a boat now. I'm going to take all this stuff off. And I'm going to redo everything. Just need to get all this stuff out of here. And clean it out. Vacuum it out. And see what this all looks like. Oh. I got a... Got a small anchor. That's cool. But... Yeah, I think it's time to get this ready because I will be going fishing this winter because I like to fish and all that stuff. But right now, hey, there's a strap. Let's just get it cleaned out and see what we can do with some of the stuff that's in here. Got a lot of rails all right that goes to the battery but i think i will be rebuying all of this stuff i'm going to rewire this entire boat it looks just like a that's got to be no good we'll get rid of that huh that's for an anchor. I don't know what I'd do with that one. But it's only a one wire system that goes down through like Connex. I'm gonna redo the plug up front. That's right here for a light so I can fish at night. Run it down the side. Maybe mount a couple lights right here, floodlights, or screw them down into this. So I can fish at nighttime, um, buy new straps for everything. Ooh. I don't have my, wow, this thing doesn't want to release. Ah, there it goes. This was to hold it onto the trailer. So we'll get, get this cleaned up so it'll work and spray it down. So that's nice. Oh, well, maybe not. But like I said, a lot of work. A lot of work. Lots and lots of work is this. That's what they used. That's an old extension cord good idea. Use an extension cord to run the wire. The bottom looks good. I just got to get all this crap taken out of here and redo it all, which is fine. I don't know what this is up here for. It's attached to the front, so we'll untie it. And then I'll bring you guys back when it's all cleaned out. Because I'm sure you don't want to sit here and watch it all being done. So we'll get back with you. Welcome back. Here, I got all the leaves out of it. Got it cleaned up. And all that good stuff. It needs, you know, a good bath. And all that also but like I said I'm gonna rewire this thing so I can have lights for nighttime fishing because you guys know I like to go nighttime fishing and all that but I'm gonna start here pull that off pull the wire and the wire just goes right along the side and it's an old extension cord should work uh, may paint this bottom 
on the sides and the inside, put some cushions, at least on the back here, and maybe up here, up here, put some cushions so that uh, your butt doesn't hurt when you're doing this and all that. I've got to take this motor, see if you guys can see it, this motor and see if I can find someone that can work on it to get it running better. And as if you can tell in the background, there's another project. I'll give you a little sneak peek. So that's what we got going on with this thing. So, and I got to clean all this up. I just took it out of the boat. I got to clean all this crap up. That's from cutting all the that up right there. The next thing I'm going to do is work on that. Try to get the rest of that concrete out of there and the rebar out right there and uh, go from there and see what I can do and maybe burn all that stuff because that is my burn pile. Start getting it cleaned up a little bit better, more level. Start filling it up with dirt and all that crap. And then that I hope to be able to start working on. Tear it down, I'll be able to get these trees down a lot easier, which that one right there that's going that way is gonna be easy. I gotta pull that sucker and pull it hard along with that one back there. So we'll see how that works. And if you guys follow along, which I think you guys will enjoy, then I'm gonna start doing videos again. Some will, some won't. Like someone said the other day, you're always gonna get criticized. Someone's always gonna hate you. But you know what? Slap it off. It's all you can do, you know? Just know that God's got your back. And I know he's got mine. Cause I've been doing a lot of soul searching over the last few months. And that's the way we're going to do it. So, oh, don't always believe what you hear unless you see the proof. Proof. It's always about the proof. Paperwork, all that stuff. Show the proof. You want to criticize someone. Let's not do that. Supposed to be a loving families, you know, on here. I'm not a part of any of these families or certain groups on here. And that's fine with me. I don't need to be. I am who I am. If I stand alone, I stand alone. But I do have several, several people that support me and back me up. So let's see if we can get to this 3K in the next couple of weeks. That would be awesome. And if we do, I'll have a giveaway. Keep watching.